What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Gerald from Bank of Gerald, here with another video update. Today is Tuesday, May the 17th, 2022. Today, we're going to talk about a platform called COTPS. We have um, started receiving a little bit of news about what is going on in the uh, platform as of today. Um, before we get started in that, I want to remind all of you that I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I am not your financial advisor. I'm just a dude on YouTube sharing with you guys how I am growing and cranking out that crypto in many different platforms, nothing more and nothing less. If you like this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you want to be updated and notified about everything going on here at BOJ, make sure you hit the notification bell as well. Um, guys, we have been hearing that COTPS um, has been still updating its members through the support team. Um, and there has been a, a recent announcement that says that COTPs, uh, well, I think we already knew this, the, per, the, the company they were using to handle their SMS um, messaging type uh, OTP code system was not the company that they were going to continue with. So they were switching to another provider. Um, some have said it's called Tencent or something like that. I don't know much about that process, but COTPS is saying in their, in their support um, chat area on their website, if you type in something, it has an automated message that comes in and says that some countries have already been restored back to normal. Um, what I'm hearing is that the United States has not returned back to normal just yet. But here's what I wanted to do. I wanted to ask those of you that are in the various countries outside of the United States, go ahead and test your COTPS uh, withdrawal um, code uh, thing. <laughs> I know I didn't say that quite right, but um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump on my COTPS really quickly and check things out. Um, as you can see, I've got a, over $4,000, $40,000, I got $41,000 in here. So um, hopefully I'll be able to have access to some of this money pretty soon and be able to withdraw. However, what I have been noticing was the main issue from this platform, of course, is the withdrawal code, right? So when we hit this message verification code, what happens is there's a countdown from 90 seconds. And what is supposed to happen in this span of 90 seconds, for those of you that did not know already is you are supposed to receive a code to your mobile device that allows you to finish out this transaction the way we are used to doing it. However, what has been going on is that this code has not been getting to our devices in a quick enough time to allow us to withdraw. So even though the functionality of the website is still functioning, you can still uh, take advantage of the, uh, the arbitrage system they've set up or whatever. Um, you can still take advantage of all that. The scripts, they're still being worked on and working. Um, the only difference is those that want to withdraw, you can't withdraw without this message verification code. It just won't allow you to do so. So with that being said, the money's still kind of locked in there. Not kind of, it is, until this message verification code issue has been fixed. So I'm doing this video right now, want to share a little bit of an update with you guys, but I want to empower you all that have COTPS accounts to just go ahead, log into your, uh, your account and click on, no matter how much you have, just go and click on withdraw and go to the message verification code section. If you receive your code in this time frame, please let me know because we're coming down on 210 and I have not received a code to my phone. Now what usually happens is less than 60 seconds later after that, I will receive the code late, all right? So at this time, when that timer goes out, you can no longer put in that code that you will receive late. Well, that's how it has been working for me previously um, when this problem started. I was getting the code late, and when you put that code in late, of course, it's not going to receive the code. So um, it seems that people are getting updates um, what has not changed, though, for us is this OTP code messaging system um, for verification on withdrawal. So there's nothing that we can do really in COTP except for just use the platform to compound whatever the figures are in there. And if you're getting referral commissions like myself and many, many others, then you can go ahead and roll those in, too. Um, because now what people are just doing is they're all, all they're doing is rolling their commissions back in or they're rolling their profits back in. They can't withdraw it. So, you know, 
most people are making it work for them. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> I'm just waiting for them to fix this OTP code so that I can withdraw. Um, if they do decide to do that, of course, we will let you guys know, and we will do withdrawals. I think their withdrawal limit is 20 grand, so we'll probably do like two transactions of 20 grand and then uh, let the rest keep rolling. But um, that's only if it becomes available. So with that being said, CLTPS is going through some issues. Um, it has been going through these issues for a while, but it, but it is a little bit promising that they are giving updates. They're saying that hopefully um, it'll be resolved soon. I don't have a time frame. Some of you may have been told a time frame. Um, but I've seen so many different time frames that I just couldn't in good conscience tell you, oh, this it's going to happen in this amount of days. <coughs> Nobody knows that information. So with that being said, put your 2FA on all the platforms that will allow you and all your wallets because crypto is indeed the wild, wild west. And if you ain't strapped, you're bound to get hacked. Ask me how I know. It's not very fun at all. If you like this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you want to be updated and notified about everything going on here at BOJ, make sure you hit that notification bell as well. I will see y'all on the next video. This is a CLTPS update, and I still have not received that OTP code. So, hey, still trying to get it fixed. Maybe it's because of the switch that I haven't received one at all now. So who knows? They could be trying to figure it out. Um, see y'all on the next one. Peace out.